So we're out for our family stroll. I still do not have my new tripod yet. And this might sound a little weird because I don't have a microphone. I mean, a little rough, I should say. But I figured while I'm out walking, why don't I tell you a little bit about why I don't support Batman Day. Do you want to see why you're interested in my opinion? Even if you're not, let's be honest, go ahead and stick around and I'll uh, explain in a moment. Hey to all my friends out there in YouTube land, it is your good buddy Fantastic Phil here and I'd like to welcome you back to my channel. So uh, we're on our evening stroll. As I said, or in my case, as I'm going to say in the introduction, so my camera work is probably gonna be a little shoddy and you're probably not gonna hear me too well, but I figure, oh well, let's just give it a shot. Uh, my wife and I and our little guy are taking a, a walk here and we have a, we're in a safe town, so we're perfectly fine. But uh, I figured, let me take this opportunity to talk to you a little bit about Batman Day. So I'm filming this Thursday, September 17th, 15th, and Batman Day, as uh, Warner Brothers, I guess, has anointed it, is uh, Saturday the 17th. And basically, it's a celebration. It's supposed to be, of course, of Batman. And I think they're releasing like a whole bunch of Batman titles this week. They've probably done that already. And, uh, you know, some stores are running specials. And DC's website is also running a couple specials as well. So, um, well, that's well and good. And look, if you're planning to go buy some Batman books, I'm certainly not discouraging you from doing so, especially from your LCS. Go support your LCS. But I'm going to tell you personally why I have a problem celebrating Batman Day. Uh, I shouldn't just say Batman Day. I shouldn't just single out Batman Day, but it's the one that's coming up on the horizon because Marvel does it with Spider-Man. I know that DC has a couple days. They have Superman Day, Wonder Woman Day. I think that's all the superhero days. And, you know, like these aren't unlike... If you see like National Hamburger Day or Taco Day or whatever. Um, you know what? As I'm walking up, there's a big crowd of people. It might be a little bit of difficult to film. So I'm going to put this down for a second. So when you come back, you'll see the scenery a little bit different. Okay. So some people were eating. I didn't want to disturb them. We're right now in front of... Uh, the pasta shop, which is uh, one of our favorite local restaurants here. Keeping it local, not sponsored. <laughs> but, uh, oops, sorry, honey, almost took her shoe off. As I was saying, um, I don't celebrate Batman Day or any of those kind of named days, and I'll tell you why. Batman's a fictional character, in case you weren't aware. I hope that you were, and if you weren't, you should shut this off and go outside. Um, Batman doesn't benefit from you celebrating Batman Day, again, because he's fictional. Even if he weren't fictional, he's like a billionaire, okay? I know that he lost his money, I think, in the most recent uh, arc, but I haven't been reading it. That's besides the point. My thing is, if DC Comics and Marvel Comics are going to celebrate anybody, why not celebrate some of the classic creators, you know? Um... I'll say this, both DC and Marvel stepped it up when some creators passed recently, like George Perez, Stan Lee. I think uh, DC had a couple uh, others going on as well. And uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. my thought is, celebrate not only the ones that have passed, but those that are alive. So why not put it across a separate day and call it like Creator Day? So I lost my train of thought we were passing the ice cream place. <laughs> and as a guy who likes ice cream, I was getting a little distracted. Uh, anywho, and you know what, it's kind of cold for uh, September evening anyway, too. I'm kind of surprised there's a lot of people getting ice cream. Uh, anyway, um, why not, instead of Batman Day on September 17th, celebrate on the 18th. And what are we going to celebrate on the 18th? Well, the 18th would have been the birthday of creator and artist... Joe Kubert. I might be a little biased, but I think that he is one of the premier talents ever in comic history. And I apologize for not looking right at the camera, but I want to make sure I don't trip. Uh, and again, I might be biased because he's got a school not too far from me. Uh, you know, he's got his kids and his granddaughter are in the business now. And look, he was, I mean, think of so many different titles and I'm losing my breath. Yes. 
that uh, he worked on for uh, DC. I know like Sergeant Rock comes to mind, but even some of the things that I've talked about here before that weren't necessarily big superhero releases like Facts from Sarajevo. My point is this, if you're gonna spend your money and you weren't planning to to begin with, um, don't support a made up day. You know, Batman Day is just so DC can sell even more Batman books than they already do. And if you looked in one of my more recent videos, I showed you half of the previews catalog that DC Connect was all Batman. And I'm not just singling out DC. Marvel's did the same thing with Spider-Man covers this month. Okay, this is a dark street, so the camera might go a little dark. It's not spooky. Don't be scared. Um... Yeah, look, Marvel is guilty of the same thing with all these different Spider-Man covers this particular month. At the end of the day, Marvel and DC are going to do something because you choose to buy or choose not to buy something. So in conclusion, I encourage Marvel, DC, and any other publishing company... Ooh, sorry, you saw my hand. Uh, I encourage all these different companies, if you're going to celebrate a day, put aside a day for the creators. We don't need a day to celebrate fake people who don't really exist. And look, again, if I was going to say, if you were planning on buying any Batman books anyway, or maybe LCS is running a special, go ahead and support your LCS, because look, they're a small business, they're a local business, they need the money too. Just don't buy anything from DC.com, at least in my opinion. Well, thanks again for watching. Uh, sorry if this video seems a little scattered. Like I said, we're walking. Enjoy the rest of your day, your evening, whenever you're watching this. Peace, love, and comics. Take care.